They are vocal, exotic and highly intelligent. A species under threat. There are fewer than 1,500 left in southern Africa. Our personal goals is to try and produce birds that can be releasable which means that they can be let go back into the wild. But for that to happen, we have to make sure they're not habituated. And that means that they don't look at people, know them, don't move towards them, they have to be completely wild. Two-month-old Nelson is one of three fledglings. He was born on an historic day, December 5th. The chicks were collected from nesting areas and brought here. The first hatchling, Nelson, Nelson was named after Madiba. Obviously, he came in just, uh, I think, a couple of days after our loss, and so we just felt we wanted to call him Nelson. More being reared in captive populations. We always try to get them to be able to hear the hornbills from hatch, 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 from very young. Um, and that noise is a... <laughs> a zoo may not be the perfect home, but for now a caring sanctuary until Nelson is released into the wild. Gillian Pillay, SABC News, Johannesburg.